Hi everybody. So this is going to be a longer video, unfortunately, I'm guessing. Um, I got tagged recently in another video from one of my subscribers. And I also noticed that this was a real popular video with some of my subscriptions. So I'm going to go ahead and do it anyway. This one is 100 questions nobody asks and there are actually 99. However, one of the girls I've subscribed to added a bonus Jonas question for the hundredth one. So I'm going to answer hers as well. And for those that are curious, her name is Graveyard Girl and you can access her down below as I have her linked in. So, number one, this is the bonus question. Something that happened to you in middle school. Well, a lot of stuff happened to me in middle school. After rewatching Graveyard Girl's video, I discovered that she meant something that happened to you that was embarrassing in middle school. So, there are very, 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 very many of those. I would definitely have to say the worst was this evil girl, um, Jennifer. And I won't share her last name because I really don't remember it. She kept messing with the hooks on my bra in gym class. So right before a fire drill, she thought it would be funny to steal it. I was not impressed. But needless to say, standing outside freezing in a fire drill with no bra was no fun. Number two. Do you sleep with the closet doors open or closed? Well, I sleep with the closet doors closed because they're in my bathroom, and if I don't, my cat will go take a nap in my laundry basket. Number three. Do you take the shampoos and conditioner bottles from the hotel? Yes, I am very guilty. I also take the little soaps and the body wash and everything else because I put them in my guest bath, and I think it's fun to do. And besides, I opened it, so they're just going to throw it away anyway. Number four, do you sleep with your sheets tucked in or out? Well, I have to assume that my sheets are tucked in, but by the time I get up in the morning, they're not anymore. Number five, have you ever stolen a street sign before? No, I have not stolen a street sign before. I have, however, watched my sister steal a construction cone. That was fun. Number six, do you like to use post-it notes? Yes and no. I, I really like the post-its, but my honest preferable is the post-its with no sticky. They're just little notepads. But then I tape them to stuff, so it's hard to say. Do you cut out coupons and never use them? I have done that before, and I have not used them just because I didn't want to buy the quantity that you had to buy to use the coupon. Number six. Would you rather be attacked by a big bear or a swarm of bees? I'm going to go with a big bear because there's a chance I could live and I'm deathly allergic to bees. Number nine. Do you have freckles? Yes, I have freckles. Unfortunately, they're not on my face. They're actually on my shoulder and body areas. So mostly they're here around my back. Oh, and then I have one on my hand, ironically enough, that reminds people of Hawaii. So, yeah. Number 10. Do you always smile for pictures? No, I don't. And the reason is because I don't really care for my smile. And that probably sounds really bad, but I just don't. Number 11. What is your biggest pet peeve? I have so many pet peeves it's hard to say, but I'm going to go with the not watching your children in public pet peeve. If you're going to have kids and you're going to take them out in public, get off the phone and pay attention to them. Number 12. Do you ever count your steps when you walk? I used to, but I don't anymore. I just got lazy. Um, one of the things I do do, which is funny enough, is I count the squares on the floor when I'm bored. So, yeah. 
Number 13. Have you ever peed in the woods? No. 14. Have you ever pooped in the woods? No. 15. Do you dance even if there's no music playing? I have tendency to do that and it's just because I'll have like a song in my head so technically there's music playing in my head. 16. Do you chew on your pens and pencils? No, I don't, but I have this terrible habit of doing this to them. The problem I run into is that unfortunately my pen is not always down, so I end up drawing all over my face. 17. How many people have you slept with this week? Well, I'm going to go with one because I sleep with him every day. 18. What size is your bed? My bed is a queen and I cannot stand it because all of the bedding that I like is either twin or full. Number 19. What is your song of the week? Well, I don't really have a song of the week, but since I saw the DVD for Footloose at Walmart, that song's often in my head. Number 20. Is it okay for guys to wear pink? Yes, it is okay for men to wear pink, purple, red, yellow, pastels, flowers, daisies, stars, moons, it does not matter. 21. Do you watch cartoons? Yes, I am a huge kid at heart. I enjoy cartoons on TV, Spongebob, Courage, some other ones. And then a lot of cartoon movies as well. What is your least favorite movie? Um, I'm going to go with Tropic Thunder or Cabin Fever. Tropic Thunder was the dumbest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. And Cabin Fever was disgusting and I ended up walking out halfway through. 23. Where would you bury hidden treasure if you had some? Well, I'm not going to tell you where I would bury hidden treasure if I had some because then you'd know where it was if I do get some. Sorry. 24. What do you drink with dinner? Well, it just depends on what's for dinner. Um, I am a Gatorade, Kool-Aid person. I also like apple juice, Pepsi Max, Dr. Pepper, root beer, cream soda, milk, juice, water. It really just depends on my mood at the time or if I'm already drinking something like if I get to dinner and I've already started this, I'll drink this. So, that's what I'm drinking with breakfast today. 25. What do you dip your chicken nuggets in? Um, I like to dip my, dip my chicken nuggets in barbecue sauce or nothing at all. 26. What is your favorite food? Oh my word, I have so many I wouldn't even know where to start. Um, you know, I'm honestly going to say chicken and dumplings, but since my grandma died, I haven't had them since, which is kind of depressing, but I can't find anyone that can make them correctly. What movies could you watch over and over and still love? Well, I would have to go with The Longest Yard, the remake with Adam Sandler, of course. Sister Act, Sister Act 2, Cool Runnings, Snow Dogs. You know, there's a bunch, actually. 28. Last person you kissed or kissed you? I'm going to go with my husband because he always kisses me goodbye when he leaves for work. 29. Were you ever a boy or a Girl Scout? No, I was not. 30. Would you ever strip or pose nude in a magazine? No way ain't happening never. In the words of Couples Retreat, my body is a Taliban. No thank you. Gross me just thinking about it. 31. When was the last time you wrote a letter to someone on paper? Um, ironically enough, I'm actually in the middle of doing that now, so I'd say today. 32. Can you change the oil on a car? No, I cannot. I can change a tire, but I cannot change the oil. 33. Have you ever gotten a speeding ticket? 
You know, I haven't gotten a speeding ticket. I've got lots of speeding warnings, though. 34. Have you ever ran out of gas? Yes, I have. It was between Carrizozo and Socorro, and it sucked. 35. What's your favorite kind of sandwich? My favorite kind of sandwich is probably peanut butter and jelly. 36. Best thing to eat for breakfast? It just depends on my mood. Today I'm having the strawberry cheesecake muffins I made earlier on my other channel. They're very good. 37. What is your usual bedtime? Well, that depends on if my body wants to be nice or hateful. 38. Are you lazy? I can be sometimes. 39. When you were a kid, what did you dress up for as Halloween? Oh my gosh, I dressed up every Halloween. I wouldn't even begin to remember everyone. That's just crazy. Wow. Is that really a question? 40. What is your Chinese astrological sign? I I want to say the rooster, which is funny because I hate roosters. 41. How many languages can you speak? Six. Working on seven. 42. Do you have any magazine subscriptions? Oh my gosh, I have so many it's not even funny. Cosmo, All You, Style, Watch, America, um, Highlights, Zoo Books, you name it. Which are better, Legos or Lincoln Logs? Oh, that's hands down, that's Lincoln Logs. There's no, there's no better than that. 44. Are you stubborn? <laughs> yeah, and if you want to know about that, ask anyone that knows me. 45. Who is better, Leno, who is better, Leno or Letterman? Um, I'm going to go with B, none of the above, because I think they both suck. 46. Do you ever watch soap operas? No, I can't stand them. 47. Are you afraid of heights? Petrified. 48. Do you sing in the car? Well, if I know the song, hell yeah. If I don't know the song and I want to know the song, I sing in the car. And if I am hooked on being neurotic over a certain song, I will sing it in the car over and over and over and over at like 500 degrees. 49. Do you sing in the shower? You know, I don't. Um, yeah, I just don't. 50. Do you dance in the car? Um, unfortunately, yes, I do. And I have tendency to dance the car when I'm on my own. So, and there's no one around. 49. Have you ever used a gun? Yes. It hurt like heck and I will never do it again. 50. Last time you got a portrait taken by a photographer? Mm, I'm gonna go with my wedding day. Yeah, I'm gonna go with that. 53. Do you think musicals are cheesy? No, I don't. I love musicals. Call me crazy. 54. Is Christmas stressful? Yeah, but it's awesome too. 55. Have you ever eaten a pierogi? Yes, I have. When I was a kid, my mom used to order from the Schwann's man, and they had these cool pierogies. Yes, I did. Now I'm going to have to call the Schwann's man because I want them. Thank you very much. 56. Favorite type of fruit pie? Um, you know, I'm going to say either apple or cherry. But then again, lemon meringue is a fruit. Well, lemon is a fruit, but... Yeah. 57. Occupations you wanted to be when you were a kid. I love how they say there's more than one. When I was a kid, I hands down wanted to be a pediatrician. And then as I got older into middle school, high school, I wanted to be a NASCAR driver. I still do. 58. Do you believe in ghosts? Oh, yes, I do. And don't mess with ghosts. Don't mess with that stuff. No, no, no. Don't mess with that voodoo. 59. Have you ever had a deja vu feeling? Yes, all the time. 60. Do you take a vitamin daily? No, I take four of them. Thank you very much. And they are in shapes of beautiful little gummy bears. 
So technically I take eight because I take four at night too. Haha. <laughs> 61. Do you wear slippers? Oh yeah. I have my own dresser just designated for slippers. I'm not even kidding. I love slippers. 62. Do you wear a bathrobe? Yes and no. Yes when I feel like it or it's cold, but not really a, a lot. 63. What do you wear to bed? Pajamas. 64. Your first concert? Reva McIntyre at Tingley Coliseum. And I'd go back in a heartbeat because she's awesome. 65. Walmart, Target, or Kmart? Oh, come on. Hands down. Anybody knows me? Walmart. I am a Walmart freak. 66. Nike or Adidas? I'm going to say Nike because when I was a kid, one of my rooms had these little blue check marks all over the place. And so I'm going to go with Nike. 67. Cheetos or Fritos? Um, well, I like puffy Cheetos and Cheetos Paws, but I can never find those anymore. And Fritos only if they're in Frito Pie. 68. Peanuts or sunflower seeds? Sunflower seeds. Hands down. No shelves or chocolate covered only. I do not like shelves. But at sports games, I like peanuts. So, yeah. 69. Have you ever heard of a group called Tribian? Um, no, I have not, but if they're going to name their group in French over a feeling, well, that's their call. 70. Have you ever taken dance lessons? Yes, um, it was required in middle school and high school for show choir. 71. Is there a provision? Is there a profession you per- is there a profession you picture your future spouse doing? Well, considering my current spouse is going to be my future spouse, I'm going to go with teaching because that's what he does. He has also said he'd like to um, get into a little bit of politics, so we'll see. 72. Can you curl your tongue? Well, I can make it a taco and I can bend it backwards. 73. Have you ever won a spelling bee? No! The one time I got close to winning, I jacked the word up and I couldn't spell gigantic to save my life. 74. Have you ever cried because you were so happy? You know, I want to say everybody has, but I can't really think of a specific time when I may have done that. 75. Do you own any records? Yes. 76. Do you own a record player? It would be kind of pointless to have records without a player. 77. Do you burn incense? No, I cannot stand incense. I don't like the little smoky tropes. No. 78. Have you ever been in love? Well, I'm married, so I'm going to go with yes. 79. Who would you like to see in concert? Dolly Parton. Hands down, no questions asked. 80. What was the last concert you saw? River McIntyre. King of Coliseum. I've only been to one. 81. Hot tea or cold tea? Both. 82. Tea or coffee? Tea. 83. Sugar or snickerdoodles? I'm going to assume you're going with cookies, so I'm going to say D, none of the above. But I like chocolate chip and gingerbread and macadamia. 84. Can you swim well? I can doggy paddle. 85. Can you hold your breath without holding your nose? That would be a yes. Can't say I like it. 86. Are you patient? It depends on who and what and all that one not. 87. DJ or band at a wedding? I'm going to go with DJ because that's what I had. 88. Have you ever won a contest? Yes. I did. I won a Valentine's contest a few about a year ago, and I got a $50 gift card and some really smelly body wash for men. 89. Have you ever had plastic surgery? No. I've had medical surgery then. 90. Which are better, black or green olives? I'm going to go with both because I love them both. 91. Can you knit or crochet? I can do both. 
I can also embroider a needle point and cross stitch. 92. Best room for a fireplace? I'm going to go with living room, dining room, eh, not really dining room, living room, bedroom, yeah. 93. Do you want to get married? Again, I'm already married and that will be three years this year. Go me. 94. If married, how long have you been married? <laughs> As I said in the last question, that'll be three years this year ago, May. 95. Who was your high school crush? Oh, I'm not telling nobody that. Uh-uh. What if he's listening? There's no way. 96. Do you cry and throw a fit until you get your own way? Um, no. I am not a toddler. Sorry. 97. Do you have kids? Well, I have, quote-unquote, Adopted kids. I have furry kids. So yeah. 98. Do you want kids? Yes, I'd love to have kids. I think it would be awesome. Especially the little girl I saw at the bowling alley this weekend. 99. What is your favorite color? Well, everybody that knows me knows very well that my favorite color is pink. Note the pink behind me. Pink on the file cabinet. Focus, pink everything, pink, 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 pink sweater. 100. Do you miss anyone right now? I miss a lot of people right now, actually. I miss my husband because he's at work and I hate that. Um, I miss my grandma because she died. I miss some of my friends and family because they don't live here. So yeah, definitely. So that is a hundred questions by me, and it only took me 21 minutes. Woohoo! Ten and a half minutes per 50. So that's pretty good. So I hope you guys do this video. Feel free to send me a video response because I'd love to hear your answers. Have a great day.